gonna fly out to Lynx Lake. Let's take off real quick. Take off. The home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. It's good. Starting here. A little gusty. See how well we do. Adjust this camera angle down. We're just going to follow this road. We're going to pit stop at uh, the Highland Center, which is a great little place to go visit. Uh, a little high, let's come down. It's kind of a little uh, nature center. Uh, and then we'll make our way over to Lynx Lake, which isn't that far from that. I am using um, some parabolic reflectors to increase range, as well as some Yagi's. Uh, the Yagi's are for the 5.8 gigahertz. This is a DJI Mini SE. Uh, I am locked in at the 5.8 gigahertz. I uh, should be able to get about 11,000 feet away. Obviously, that's going to be a hardcore line of sight. Pardon all the background noise. down a little bit maybe just maybe we'll see some animals or something we're actually passing a trailhead right now on the way back we'll take a better look at it I always fly higher than I should I'm worried about seeing power lines it's it's kind of hard to see on this screen don't recall ever seeing them, but I bet you 150 feet should be all right. We'll drop down to that elevation, or altitude, I should say. Eighty-nine percent battery. There's a little bit of a wind pushing me. I'm hitting 18 miles an hour, sometimes a little higher. In normal mode, or P mode as it looks like in the corner here, um, I do about 17, 17.8 17 miles per hour. So just got to know when we, when it's time to come back, it's time to come back. No one wants to fight the wind. over so we can see this road. Just reached over a mile. Upper left hand corner, we might start to see the lake. I should say the upper left hand corner now. I might be wrong. Kind of being out in the middle of nowhere. It's expected to have decent satellite, uh, GPS satellites. We got 17 of them. Eighty-two percent battery. Now, 
off in the mountains you see in the distance. Uh, there was a fire going on over there uh, a few weeks ago. And the Forest Service had made uh, this entire area a no-fly zone. So a few weeks ago we wouldn't have been able to make this flight. That is the lake in the upper left corner. You start to see some of that blue. Seventy-nine percent battery, seventy-eight. The Highland Center should be coming up any second. Starting to get a little jittery on the feedback. Aircraft interference. I'm going to raise this up. Maybe a little higher would work. comes the Highland Center. Let's see if we can kind of fly around it. You know, it's hard to explain what, what they do there other than uh, teach the community about nature. They have summer camps for kids, uh, trails that just really run throughout. Um, they run throughout the forest here. A little amphitheater, uh, just a great place to go on, to with, on a short hike with the family. Let's bring it back up. We should see the lake. There's the lake. Getting quite a bit of signal interruption here. this camera a little bit. Maybe the other way. Just crossing 10,500 feet. Means we're at the two mile mark for sure. 70% battery life. Getting quite a bit of feedback, or uh, not feedback, but um, just jittery, jittery photo or uh, video. Let's see if we can raise this up a little bit. So this is Lynx Lake. You can camp around here. There's a couple campsites. There's a restaurant. I believe you can even fly your boat. Fly your boat. Jeez. Fly your drone. Uh, but take your your boat out on it if you would like. At 67%, we should be turning around here soon. Let's just park it real quick. Do a quick once around. Officially over the lake. There we go, eleven thousand five hundred. That's a new record. Uh, let's start heading back. Line right for home. Not too bad, 11,500 feet. My math is poor, it's two point something miles. 
Looks like we're fighting a little bit of wind, just a small amount. We should be quite all right. I've actually done this flight before. Haven't gone 11,500 feet, but um, I have I have made it, and usually I come back home with plenty of battery. 60% still in the green. And winds have to be swirling because sometimes I'm going 16 miles an hour. Now I'm going 18.3. Let's see if we can bring it down a little bit. get a little closer to home uh, wouldn't mind kind of exploring a little bit but there's not a lot of green in the battery as, as you see it's left See, kind of middle of the screen to the right, there appears to be a trail or a road. Wouldn't mind taking that one day and seeing where that leads. You can see this high altitude warning that I always have up here. Um, you can see it talks about aircraft braking distance. Uh, that's really because of my location, we're about 5,000 feet in elevation. Uh, I notice when I'm off in the Phoenix area, I don't, I don't get that warning. Looks like we're doing quite all right, 51%. Closer to the trees and let's try a hundred and about a hundred and fifty feet, make sure we're all right. Man, it would suck to clip a top of a tree. I know I'm pretty far away, but Lose the drone quite yet. Interesting the way that the wind is swirling around. Just under a mile left, as you can tell. Just in some of the settings on the camera. <clears throat> Here's that trailhead I was talking about. Come down a little bit, see if there's any activity here. Oh, someone's about to pull in.
That's enough spying on people. Obviously, I say that joking. You can't see anything with these cameras if you wanted to. I'm actually going to cross the street here. traffic and houses on this side. I really don't like flying over people and houses unless I... It's kind of the only option. Come up in elevation a little bit. You can see home is about a half a mile away. 30% still in the green. hotels there. We're going to come right to the right of that beige hotel that's on the other side of the highway. And then we should there's an apartment complex just up top corner of your screen right now, kind of middle top corner. That's where we're headed. Taking line of sight any moment now, still can't see the drone. I'm standing about middle of the screen right now. A little patch of grass. Bring it back. I thought I was getting eaten alive out here. I got a bunch of mosquitoes, I noticed now. Landing. Landing. And there we go. Great flight, guys.